three, two, one, go. And for the first 15 seconds, the human players are not involved. It's all in the programming. See how well they work. 63-40 and 60-23, gaining 12 points for their alliance by docking and engaging. The two bots that moved out for the Red Alliance gained three points. 80-80 gained three points as well. As it's 30-25 to 25, coming out of Autonomous with oh, a little over two minutes of action left. The first 15 seconds is programmed by the human players. And then for two minutes and 15 seconds, the humans take control of the bots, moving them up and down the field. There goes 92-93, jumping across the border, picking up one of those power cubes as their alliance partner scores on the high metal pole. Kind of like those poles you see on the side of the road, those big old tall metal structures. Place it on top of that, that gets you five points. Placing it in the middle row gets you three. And if you can just drop it down on the ground there in the low row, you get two points. That's 63.40. Placing it high atop that tower for another five points on the Red Alliance as it's 63 to 41, 80, 80. The Sequoia Robotics team dances around trying to score that cube in the low row. It bounces around. It can only be in one node at a time. But if they can get three side by side, either low in the middle or high, they will form a link in their community's power grid, giving them five points. It's now 70 to 46 with 45 seconds left to go in a match. Action still taking place on the field at 63, 41, and 45, 16. Do the salsa in the middle of the field. We're down to 34 seconds left to go, and we're approaching the end game, the final 30 seconds where a lot can happen. 63, 41, jumping off on to the charging station. They're docked, and they're engaged which means that they're plugged into the community, starting the flow of electrons at 6023. Tries to squeeze in between 80-80, trying to gain an additional 10 points. For the Blue Alliance at 6023, trying to climb up. They're going to try to dock and get level. They're still trying to maintain the level condition. That's going to be interesting. The refs are going to have to take a look at that. I can't tell whether 6023 is touching the platform. If they had been touching the platform, they would not be credited with being engaged. They would be just be credited with the points for a dock, which would have been worth six points instead of ten. All right, here we go. Let's take a look. The F1 leaves off with the Red Alliance at a 107 to 66 victory. The Red Alliance was able to charge their power grid significantly more than the Blue Alliance right there. As they both gained a ranking point for gaining more than 26 points in, in uh, the charge station.